What is going on everybody? Welcome back to my Super Mario Galaxy 2 Let's Play. So on the last part, I believe we did the Yoshi Star Galaxy and the Flip Switch Galaxy. Let's come back to the helm. And so I forgot to show you, but um, I think I forgot to show you, but if you uh, actually get past one of the uh, the secret galaxies, sometimes you can get to this uh, little thing that gives you more star bits. That's all it is though. You can't even... Yeah, you can't even go past that. It's just for that. So. Let's come here to the Spin Dig Galaxy, another new galaxy. You can see that spinning drill there, that's going to be a new thing that's going to be introduced here. So, Dig a Legs Planet. Obviously a reference to Mega Leg from the first game. And it's very similar too. It's like Mega Leg Sun or something. You'll see. And I'm not sure how loud my voice is, or if it's picking too much from the TV, like if it's echoing too much. For some reason, like, the mic settings glitched, and they all reset, so I had to- I forgot, like, what they were set to, so... I think I have them set to what they were. I, I'm not too sure, though, so I'll look back. I'm sorry if it's echoing too much, I really, uh, can't tell. So let's see. You actually can, uh, this is a new power-up, it's the, uh, spin drill, and you shake the Wii Remote. And if there's, like, a planet made out of dirt like this or something, you shake the Wii Remote, and you go through it to the other side. How cool is that? So like these craters right here. Usually they lead to something like this. Look at this. Ack, how did you get up here? Keep an eye out for the other Lumas ahead. Try to find them too. I like how Mario just carries it. It's all giant. Yeah, when you go to a launch star, you get rid of it. You just hold it for the time being. Got these flower enemies or something. Yeah, this galaxy is obsessed with spinning. Yeah, you can't attack them while they're spinning. I think you might be able to jump on them. Yeah, but that's it. Okay. So, let's drill to the other side. Let's see what's over here. Now the camera is, like, upside down, too. We gotta kind of find a way to do this. Let's see. So, okay, so you actually have to go on the square, and then it leads up here drill here, and it leads all the way up here, look at this, okay, let's talk to this guy, whoa, where'd you come from, more Lumas are waiting for you up ahead, okay, let's go, this galaxy was actually one of my favorite galaxies from this game, I don't know why, I just thought it was cool, so here we got a uh, bonus planet thing, alright, got an invincibility, Let's kill all these flower guys. I think we'll be able to get everything on this planet. There's only like eight. Okay, got the three one-ups. Let me try to get all three of them. And yeah, just like the last game, this uh, whenever you start up the game again, it sets you back to five lives. Kind of like Kirby. Kirby always does that. And they put that in this game for some reason. But um, ouch. I thought I was going to go the other way. I guess I was wrong. Let's wait for, let's wait for one to stop. I actually need to get a coin. Oh, there's a coin right here. Never mind. Okay. Okay, let me just be safe about this. Forget that, forget that. Th these are just coins. Okay. Oh, there is a Luma right there. He trolled me. He made me go back. Okay. Alright, let's go. Sorry to keep you waiting. Better be sorry. Okay. So, got Goombas on this planet. This planet looks like rock, but I think it's just like... dirt or something. It's weird. Let's see. Kill this Goomba off. Okay. Yeah, I got Spin Drill. Let's come over here now. And I believe you can actually... Yeah, there's an inside to this planet. It's like hollow. I remember there was like a hollow planet somewhere. The camera's really weird. This is... This is weird. Get all the coins, though. Okay, so then you just drill right here and come up here, and let's go. Yeah, it's you, Mario, right? Like our new ship? It's called a Star Shroom. We're showing- we're shoving off soon. Oh yeah, I forgot to introduce myself. I found this nifty headlamp, so I am now the Toad Brigade Captain. There's a pretty scary monster just past here. Be careful. Well, let me tell you something, Sonny. One day... You are going to get your own game. Okay. 
I actually can't wait for Captain Toad. Uh, December 5th, I think, is when it comes out. I actually... I'm not gonna get it the day it comes out. I'm trying to save up for other things. But I can't wait for it. It's gonna be so cool. Luma Lee, Luma Bob, welcome to the Luma shop that we saw in the first game. I can sell you something helpful for only 30 star bits. Okay, let's let's get something then. Which will be... Let it, let's get ourselves some extra lives. I think we have enough one-ups. I'm only taking this offer because I can. I'm not trying to make myself look bad at this game, but, I mean, he's giving me a good offer. I mean, I'm not gonna decline that offer, so we got a checkpoint right there. And here he is, this is Digga Leg. As you can see, it's kind of like a mini Mega Leg. You can't climb on them, though. You just gotta drill into him. Yeah, like I said, he looks like Mega Leg's son. He basically is. Okay, so he actually, uh... He tries to uh, drill into the ground and he'll send out those uh, little guys. So now he's gonna hop to the other side. And I believe you can actually just jump on them, yeah. You just jump on them and they turn into a coin. Okay. Where's he gonna go? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Okay. Drill. Oh no. Okay. That should hit. Yeah. Oh, he needs to be hit one more time. Okay. Okay. Ouch. That's okay. These guys always drop coins. That just came out of nowhere. Oh, he killed his own son. Wow, I, I put a coin on the other side. Look at that. Okay. It didn't actually give me a coin. Oh well, I, it's not like I needed that extra life or anything. Okay, ouch. Why am I getting hit so much? Oh, that was smooth. Oh no, I swear I'm not doing good today. I'm so sorry. Gotta make this count, though. Okay, this should hit. Yeah, that somehow worked. I don't know why. I thought it would hit his leg again. That camera was really weird though, like I could barely see him. And since it's like a 2D circular planet, that's not always the best control. Yeah, that doesn't always have the best controls when it comes to 2D circular planets. But oh well, we still killed him. Oh, we got the star. Okay. Got an extra life. You actually do get one-ups from getting coins like that. Alright, so we unlocked two new galaxies. Look at that. Let's check them out. Oh, one of my little guys is back. I was wondering what happened to the little feller after he fell off. I can only imagine that in Mr. Krabs' voice. He built, he built a ship to get back, huh? That's my crew for you. Uh, those guys are all friends of yours, right? No, I want to kill them. If you ever want to visit that ship, you can get there with the warp pad. Okay. So, as you can see, you got a li uh, little warp pad over here and by Mario's ear. His ear hole. Just be prepared, Toad. You will get your own... You, you will get your own game one day. Just... Just be patient. It'll take four years, but you'll eventually get it. Because this game came out in 2010. See what I did there? Okay. So. Wow, that, 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 was, that was smooth. Okay, Mario just did that. Now let's come back here. Alright, let's see. Which galaxy should we do first? I don't think this leads anywhere, so let's do the right side down galaxy. Yeah, it's a, it's a one mission galaxy. So let's do it. Okay. Breaking the laws of gravity, as if this game didn't already do that. Okay. So I got a... Yeah, little preview. I thought we were gonna land on that uh, toad spaceship, the Star Shroom, as he calls it. But I guess not. Okay. So it's all like, I don't know what the word for it would be. I just did that, okay. Yeah, I just did that too.
see that. There's a toad here. What does he want? Oh, coins. Okay. What does this guy want? I think he has glasses. You got it. I did get it. Thank you, Mr. Smarty Toad. Nerd Toad. That's what I'm gonna call him. Nerdy Toad. I thought I could lawn jump over him. Oh yeah, you gotta flip the gravity. I forgot. That Goomba is walking on the switch. Hey, can you move out of the side? Move to the side. Okay. So you hit the switch and the gravity flips and now you can kill him. Okay. Now he's gone. Let's, let's do this. Look at this. We got a fire flower. A new power up in this game. Transform the fire Mario. Shake the Wii remote to shoot fireballs. Just like in the first game. Except in this game we get it extremely early. In the last game we didn't get it until like halfway through the game. But in this they kind of show you early on. There's a one up in there. Okay. We can break these two. Okay. So let's come to this pipe over here. Whatever this is. Not this again. Oh my. Oh no. Come on. Wait. Let me just talk to him. Okay. This is the end of the road for all the trash in the universe. So many boxes. It's getting way out of control if you ask me. Do me a favor and burn all these as fast as you can. What do you say? Um. Okay. Alright, I'll leave you to it. Alright, so it's Revenge of the Robot Guy that makes you clean up the trash. How wonderful. But this time, instead of throwing those bombs, now we actually have to burn all of the boxes up. Shouldn't be too hard. Just gotta have some good aim. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do this. Oh, we were close, though. That was close. I don't know, because there's only one star. I'm not sure if he even gives you anything. That one, dude, you gotta put her back into it. What? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna... Yeah, goodbye. So that is Revenge of the Robot Guy. He, he would... Yeah, I'm not dealing with him, though, because this... Yeah, this galaxy only has... Maybe that's a secret star, though. It just doesn't show up on the mission select or something on the, uh... Yeah, the, it probably, it's, it's probably another star. It just doesn't show up. Like, in the other uh, star slots. Whatever they are. But, um... Yeah, I don't really want to deal with that right now. Let's just move along over here. So we got a giant piranha plant. And then you beat him up. Okay. So the gravity's still upside down. Okay, now it's normal. Oh, look at that. Double kill right there. What's that up there? Okay, I guess I'm not getting it. Okay, alright, we got the checkpoint. Let's come here now. Yeah, I really hope that this isn't too echoey. I'm so I'm very sorry if it does because, like I said, I don't know what happened with my mic. It's just I think these are the right settings. It's actually like showing up a little bit on the playback. Hopefully, it's usually the playback, uh, like the monitor, it lies to me. So hopefully, yeah, you want to be careful there. Oh, I just realized you're supposed to flip the gravity. Well, there's no way I'm getting out of this, am I? I feel like I should just have to. Wait. Yep, there I go. Okay. Yeah, I forgot about the switch up here. I didn't realize. Alright, so now we're all good to go down there, I think. At least we got that one up right before we died, so it's at almost as if it doesn't really count. Okay, let's just grab it again. Yeah, it's as if that never happened. Okay. So let's just come here now. Gotta watch out for the chain chomps, and there's thwomps too. Make sure they don't crush you. They're awfully huge though, like... Compared to the regular games, th these swamps are just extremely huge. Oh, I don't want to get crushed. I'm trying to go for that Comet Metal. I think I know what I have to do. Um, let's see. Yeah, I think you gotta come down here. Uh, I'm gonna get that. Alright, I got it. 
So that's what you have to do. You kind of have to like jump. Oh no, I'm gonna get crushed. Okay. Just had to be safe. Okay, now we can come down here. So I actually got the Comet Medal on my first try. I don't know how. So we got another uh, Fire Flower right here. Okay, somehow did that. There we go. Let's grab these. Come down here, burn everything up. Let's go. He died. Oh, they, they have gravity. Okay. Alright, let's keep going. Alright. It's burning everything up. Yeah, these boxes actually do have gravity mechanics. I was gonna say, I don't know why they would be stacked then. Okay. Alright, so I got a checkpoint. Gravity is actually, like, on the wall now. Look at this. Burn that. Burn everything up. Let's just go. Just burn him out of existence. I didn't even throw a fireball at him. He just died from my fists. Okay. Just come here now. Got a bunch of coins. Get out of here. Yeah, he died. Okay. He died too. And also him. That was a good finale. Okay. Womps just gotta be careful around here. Yeah, they even give you a little thing because this is very overwhelming. It can be, at least. Oh, this toad is napping upside down. How wonderful. I wish I could do that in the morning. So forget about the one-up. Just get that star like that. And that was the right side down galaxy. Pretty easy enough, at least. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna go back for that, uh, revenge of the robot guy who makes you clean up all the trash. I don't feel like dealing with him. That was it for that galaxy. Let's just say I did it. Okay. Yeah, I think it would've said galaxy complete if I- if that was the only star, but that is, like, a secret star. But, like I said, let's just forget about it. Is this guy new or something? Didn't notice him. When you want to crit- when you want to quit, press it. Yeah, yeah, I know. On a long trip like this, be sure to take breaks from time to time. Thanks for reminding me about life. I forgot about that thing, you know, called life. Okay. So let's come up here. Oh, the fluffy bluff galaxy. No, this isn't the one with the bird. Never mind. Is it? I don't know. Search for the toad brigade captain. Yeah, I don't think this is the one with the bird that you have to ride. No, this is a different one. Okay. Yeah, this is this one. I remember this galaxy. I think this is gonna be the last mission for this video, so... Let's climb up this tree. Yeah, I think I can explore around a little bit. This video is only at about 18 minutes, I think. So. Yeah, this should lead me to a good half an hour or something. Okay, we got this bird. And he actually tries to come down and kill you, but then you stomp on him. Alright, got star bits and all these uh, flowers right here. Let's not worry about that, though. Just come here. Just go in the water. Get this. Oh, we got, uh, more star bit meteors. Okay. I believe there's something over here, or... Yeah, there's a pipe over here. Let's see what's down here. Okay, let's grab this, see what happens. Oh, coins. And I believe you have to, like, get all the coins, and then another set shows up, or... No, I guess that was it then. Okay. Or maybe I just didn't get the last coin at the last second. Because I believe it's like you have to get the first set, then another set shows up. I guess I just didn't get the last coin. Oh well. So now we got these wood guys. I think they show up a few times in this game. Cloud Step. So this is a new power-up called the Cloud Flower, and we turn into Cloud Mario. Shape the Wii Remote to create up to three cloud platforms out of thin air. So basically, as you can see, there's three little clouds following behind me. And you, uh, shake the Wii Remote, and you make a cloud like that. You can make another cloud. And you can only make up to three at a time, then you gotta get another cloud flower in order to, uh, get your ammo back. 
So let's come over here. And it really does get annoying sometimes, and if you touch the water, it disappears for whatever reason. And, um... So I got these green versions of the other guys, and they actually throw two rocks at you. So, yeah. Got another cloud flower. And, um, if you don't have the cloud power-up, Mario actually, like, becomes lighter or something. Because if you try to go on these clouds without the cloud flower, you'll just... They'll disappear, kind of like the flowers and be Mario from the first game. Alright. I couldn't really see, but I did it anyways. And, it, and I was, I was going to say, it does kind of get annoying sometimes, because sometimes when you try to, like, do a double jump or something, you know, just to, uh get across a platform or something, you'll accidentally make a cloud if you still have a cloud left in it. It's not that bad, though. They only put the cloud, uh, cloud flowers and the cloud, uh, yeah, they only put the cloud flowers where you really need them and you're not going to need to double jump all the time. So it's not like it annoys you all the time. Alright, let's see. Got a bunch of coins from this. Alright. And they do disappear after a while, you gotta be careful about that, too. Just do this. Yeah, that was professional. I don't know how I did that, but that was that was pretty sick, if you ask me. Got all these star bits on the cloud. I can't reach them. I was too far away. Watch out. Okay, let me... Let me actually read it. Okay, there we go. Watch out for cosmic clones ahead. If they come after you, run! So, um... Alright, yeah, we can't use the cloud flower at all. So, here is a, uh, evil clone, kind of like the, uh, the blue one, uh, from the blue comet in the first game, but this time there's multiple of them, and it's not like a separate mission, they're just, they show up in a certain segment and they try to chase after you. And then when you get all the, uh, designated things that you have to collect, they just all turn into star bits, so that's all nice. So that's the comet metal, can I get up there? I can get up there. I think what I need to do... No. Wait, hold on. You gotta get on it. I don't know, I don't remember how I got this Comet Metal. I was just standing on this thing a couple minutes ago. A couple seconds ago, rather. Yeah, I don't know how to get that. Forget it. I'll just come back to it later. Probably you probably have to get in another mission because uh, there, like I said, there's not a uh, separate comet medal for every mission. It's just one across the entire galaxy, so you can really get it in any mission that you go to that planet. I somehow missed that. Okay, just step on him though. All right, he's dead. What's this toad doing back here on its tree? Our captain chased that monkey. I just couldn't keep up. So tired. You don't look tired, you look like you're shivering, like you're cold or something. Okay, so we got another cloud. Let's get this. Okay. There's a one up up there. It's gonna disappear. Oh, I somehow did that. That was smooth right there. Okay, let's come up here now. I think there was another way I was supposed to take, but whatever. I just did that. Okay. Okay. Alright. Let's see. Okay, let's just kill this guy. Alright. Kill all these guys. Just get rid of them. Okay, let's climb up this tree. There should be something up here. Oh, just a coin. Okay, I just did that. You have to jump across because you gotta get across the water. Yeah, I don't know why the water makes you lose it. Maybe because, like... I don't know. I don't know why it does that, but it just does that. So you gotta... You gotta accept the fact that you lose your cloud power-up when you, uh... touch water for some... odd reason. That's no big problem. Let's just come up here. Oh, there's the toad. Captain McGee. Gasp. Yeah, some monkey with sunglasses challenged me... to a race. You go instead. I should be in better shape. This captain business is going to be harder than I thought. Alright, so Mr. Captain McGee is like all weird or something. Oh wait, I already talked to him. Okay, I just talked to him from really far away, I guess. Yeah, I just talked to him from really far away. Okay. 
so yeah, now I have to make it over here. I did that without even using my clouds. Alright, let's just climb up here, I guess. Look at this guy. Whoa, it's you. Good work getting up here. They call me the chimp. Seems like you may be a worthy high-climbing rival. Take this star, we'll talk later. So, he's not gonna race us just yet, and... Just like the, uh... The, uh, the, the robot that makes you clean up the trash. This is another one of my arch enemies in this game. He is also an insane mental guy or something. I don't know. But we got a star from him, apparently. And where are we now? You may be wondering. Well, we're about to find out in a second. Okay. My coin's got another one up, even though I'm going to lose all of them when I exit the game. Okay. So we can now go there, but... Let's see. Alright, listen up. Because I don't want to say this more than once. See that toad? He started collecting star bits for safekeeping. Think, thinks he's, a, he's some sort of happy bank or something. Why don't you go over there and check it out for me? Look at that. I see you brought back some kind of a floaty souvenir. It's a cloud flower? Wow. There sure is some weird stuff out there, huh? This guy's never seen the true meaning of life. So here, just like the uh, the first game, this uh, starship actually does have a core that gets bigger every time you uh, put in a grand star. And, um, yeah, it's like in this weird room or something, instead of just in the middle. So, yeah, we can just come out here. And it's under Mario's cap like that, it's like in that little helm up there. So, um, yeah, I think that really wraps, up, uh, wraps it up for this video, as you can see. The next uh, video is going to be the boss stage for this world, you can see on the mini-map. And um, yeah, I guess that does it for this part, so don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed watching this video, and subscribe to stay updated for more Super Mario Galaxy 2. That is all for now.